Hey guys, welcome to Joy of the Trade. Today, I want to take a look at a sector of global markets that's getting a lot of attention right now, and rightfully, rightfully so. Those are Chinese stocks. For those of you guys that have been paying attention, Chinese stocks listed in the United States, listed outside of China, have been getting smoked. They've been getting whacked lately. And there's a bunch of different ways to play this. But the main reason that's happened is because there's tension between the United States and China. Believe it or not, Joe Biden has continued a lot of Donald Trump's uh, saber rattling with the Chinese. And unlike Trump, who was really focused on just, you know, negotiating really good um, uh, trade clauses, Mr. Biden and his administration have a uh, existential uh, disgust with some of the stuff that Chinese do, the Chinese regime do with human rights, et cetera, et cetera. And they've been aggressive. Nonetheless, the market has been weak and these stocks are getting smoked. So let's take a look at some of these. Let's take a look at some of these charts right now. This is, this is the FXI. So I'm always looking at, I'm always looking at the FXI. This is, Chinese stocks that are listed in Hong Kong, not quite the US names. We'll take a look at that in a minute, but look how this is breaking down here. It's already 17% off highs that we made in February. We're breaking down on the FXI below the 200 day moving average. We've already broke the 50, we've already broke the 100. Volume is huge on these sell-offs. If this thing doesn't hold, because we've bounced, we've bounced a couple of times here off this off this level right here, 45-ish, it's got to hold 45. If we go below 45, you can expect to retest this 40 low on the FXI. I'm bearish. I think we're going to do it. So FXI is one to look at. I trade a, uh, if, if you look at this, if, if, if you know how to trade pairs, you can, you can have a market neutral point of view. You don't have to take any risk and you can put on a pair trade. I do it all the time in a service called the money links and just look at this. So we don't care if the market's going up. We don't care if the market's going down. We just think that the United States, for instance, is going to do better than China. And so if we look at this comparative return chart here, this is five years, S and is 91% FXI is 38%. Let's look at year to date. What's happened. Not too much, but it looks like it's going to start to spread out again with this outperformance. We go a full year, 50% versus 18%. And the way I trade it is like a trend follower. I expect this trend of outperformance to continue. I expect that to continue. I'll give you another example. Look at this. This is Amazon and Alibaba. Alibaba is another stock that's been getting absolutely destroyed. Amazon, if we look over the last five years, outperformed has outperformed Alibaba by 234%. I expect that to get even crazier and to continue. There's so much pressure against Alibaba. They're talking in the US about delisting this company. They're talking in China about regulating them and restricting the amount of things that they can do. They're just getting it from all sides. So if you look at Alibaba's stock, it's actually kind of like the FXI, but I think this actually has even further to go on the downside. So we also trade the pair with, I also like to put on the Amazon Alibaba spread. So I'll do the FXI S&P spread. I'll do the Amazon Alibaba spread, but this Baba chart looks terrible. This thing looks like it's going to come back down here close to 150 in no time. And I could see the big story, the big surprise of 2021 being crazy stuff that happens with China geopolitically. So let's keep an eye on that. If you guys want to learn how to trade the short side, if you want to learn how to buy puts, if you want to learn how to put on spreads, put on money links, put on, chair, uh, put on pair trades and money links, check out themoneylink.com. If you're watching this on YouTube right now, like the video first and subscribe to Wealth Press. LFG guys, have a great weekend.